Good day, viewers. Welcome to Afri's Concept TV, your number one reliable channel where you get updated and enlightened on what is happening around you. I appreciate you for the time spent while watching and viewing our channel. So if you are new on this channel, don't forget to click on the subscribe button as well as the bell button to get updated whenever I drop any video. Trending news. If you use your powers negatively, posterity will haunt you. Jonathan tells Buhari. Former President Jonathan Goodluck has advised President Momodu Buhari to use his power to strengthen democracy in Nigeria. Jonathan gave his advice during the inauguration of the first flowover bridge in Adoekiti and Ekiti State Capital. I call on Mr. President to use his powers to strengthen democracy in Nigeria, he said on Friday. Jonathan believes that advanced countries of the world today achieved greatness from the selfless sacrifices made by both leaders and followers. Part of the sacrifices made by their leaders includes not interfering with the democratic process that brings in successive leaders into office. All the great democracies you are seeing in the world, those great countries were built by people who made sacrifices to make their countries great. While admitting the pressure from different quarters on the president, Jonathan, however, reminded the successor that his deeds will go a long way in the nation's history books. He therefore called on Buhari not to bow to pressure by attempting to subjugate democracy in Nigeria, as doing that would amount to undermining the country's path to greatness. I am using this opportunity to call on Mr. President. I was there and I know where you are there. There is so much pressure from everybody to use all the powers you have to subjugate democracy. Don't do that because what you go with is the name that you leave behind. If you see your powers negatively, posterity will haunt you. Jonathan also used the opportunity to commend Nigerian youths whom he described as great and hardworking people. Although he admitted that the youth were confronted with challenges, especially not being encouraged with creativity. He called on governments at all levels to encourage them to be hardworking. He further stated, we have challenges, no power for creativity. With the limits we have, we know the great things you are doing. The former president expressed optimism that with the level of support by the people, the PDP is a party to beat in the forthcoming election. Jonathan further called on Ekiti people to vote for the People's Democratic Party, PDP, in the July 14 governorship polls, which thanking them for their support to Governor Ayodele Fayoshi. Thank you, viewers, for listening to this news. What would you have to say concerning this news that you just listened to? If you have comments on this news, kindly drop your comments below. Click on the subscription button as well as the bell button to get updated whenever I publish any video. Thank you and God bless you.